Hello, this is a quick video demonstrating our custom Voice Recognition Australia settings for the Philips SpeechMic Premium Air and how to use them with Dragon. To do this demonstration, I'll be using an Outlook email, however these buttons will work with any environment. The first functionality I will demonstrate is the EOL Prior and Ints Over buttons. These have been bound to Tab and Shift to Tab respectively, which allows you to quickly navigate between text fields. This is particularly useful when filling out a form, changing fields, or sending an email. You can see my cursor changing fields like so. The I button is bound to opening the dictation box. If Dragon doesn't recognize the environment you are trying to dictate in, it will open the dictation box as an intermediary between Dragon and the program. This allows you to attain full text control which is the ability to correct, select, and delete words verbally, as well as control your location within the text. Our default settings for Dragon Medical is that the dictation box will open automatically when you start dictating in an unfamiliar environment. However, you can also force it to open with the I button. The other half of the dictation box is the Transfer Text button, which is bound to the Play Pause button on the microphone. Once you have finished dictating into the dictation box, you can press the transfer text button to deposit the text wherever your cursor was. The record button is the most important button you have available. It will toggle the microphone on and off. When you press the button once, the microphone is on and receiving everything that you say. When you press it again, the microphone will turn off. We can configure it so that the microphone is only recording when you are holding the button. However, most users find it difficult to hold it down for extended periods. You can use the rewind button to select one word backwards. If you hold this, it will select multiple words. This is useful for correcting a mistake or deleting some characters. The fast forward button is used to move between dragon fields. These fields are anything that's enclosed with square brackets and particularly useful when creating commands or templates. Insert email command. As you can see here, I'm using my fast forward button to navigate between some dragon fields. The middle section is used as a mouse control. The left and right buttons correspond to the left and right mouse click. The center button is a mouse control, allowing you to operate the computer without using the mouse. The F1 button acts as a delete key for deleting letters, words, paragraphs, or spacing. The F2 button is bound to the enter key, so you can use it to submit forms, skipped prompts, or begin a new line or paragraph. The F3 key and F4 key work in conjunction. The F3 key will select everything up until that point, and the F4 key will read it back to you with Dragon. This is particularly useful for checking an email after you've dictated it, or a patient letter in a medical record. The two rear buttons on the back are not bound to anything by default to prevent accidental pressing. However, if you ask your trainer or technical support to configure them for you, they will. The PDF demonstrating the custom key binds shown on your screen is available from our website at www.voicerecognition.com.au and you can also find a link to it in the description below. You can also call us for more information or support with your microphone on 1300 255 900. Thank you for watching.